after spending one night at Osama's family's home, today when I woke up, I felt I aged 10 years, and I looked like I aged 10 years. You know, it's very primitive here. The bathroom downstairs, yes, it, it has a regular toilet, but they put upholstery on the toilet seat. It's like, no, 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 I can't have that. I've been in third world countries before and, you know, was able to make do. I'm good at making do, but this is making don't, honey. The shower, it's like a hole in the ground with a whole garden hose. It's like, it took an act of God for me to get ready. There's no railings on the stairs. I don't know why everyone's not walking around with a neck brace from falling down the damn stairs. This ain't my nest, I'm telling you that right now. I got to shake Osama somehow, bribe him, do whatever it takes. But get me the hell out of Chemisec. You see those, those, those trees there? Yes. It's a farm. Let's go to the fence because the sun goes away. Today, Osama's showing me around his family's farm. I'm real excited. It's like, this is everything I've been looking forward to. It's so beautiful. Yep. This is a painting. I told you. Even though this morning his parents were being so accepting and kind, they're also saying that I'm taking their son to the United States, and I'm like, now, how is this coming into the picture? We need to have a sit-down, serious talk before we can move forward. It's like, who is this guy? I've got a new friend over there. You want to see him? They want to see Miss Debbie. Oh, look at his ears. You want to play with me? Come see Mama. Mama love you. Pretty. Pretty. My pretty. To ra lu ra lu ra To ra lu ra la To ra lu ra lu ra That's an Irish lullaby You gonna let Miss Debbie ride you? I saw that sweet donkey and something came over. Oh, please let me ride that donkey. Maybe you loved me a little bit, just a little bit. Oh, I got a kiss. Osama, he kissed me. I speak the language of donkey, I think. Let me try it. We have to bench because the sun goes out. But I want to ride the donkey. I have always had an affinity for animals and I connect with them. Not too fast. Oh, Osama. Okay, Osama, slow down, please. My, I don't have a butt. God didn't give me a butt, Osama! No, no. <laughs> 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 you did that on purpose, I don't do this, no. Damn it, Osama. Okay. I told you to be careful with the donkey. I always told you this because it's you were fun. It's not the donkey, it's you. No, no, it's not me, it's not me. I told yeah, you it's not it's me. Yeah, it's you, man. <laughs> Lord have mercy, why do I always do something clumsy and podunk? It's like, let me retain my dignity and gather myself up off the ground. But I love animals. I have to give myself some nice lips. <laughs> I never like to be an old lady in my paintings. I'm always young in my paintings. Can I make it quiet so I can think? And know some, okay, I'll shut up, okay. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Ba -da -bum, ba -da -bum. Ba -da -bum. It feels like a relief. Yep, it's like far away from the noises. Yes, far away from everything. What's your idea of what comes next for you and me? What do Our you plans. mean? What are Osama's plans? Osama, I just want to paint and forget about everything. Because it's not the right time to talk about plans now. It's well, time for creating. 
You can do both at the same time. No, I can't. I have one mind, not two. It's been difficult bringing this up to Osama, but this is important. He needs to, like, put his input in that, yeah, we're going to look for apartments. Yes, we're going to Rabat, and this is the best possible place that we can have this conversation. We need to have plans for our future. Yep. But we come I... here just to divide the donkey and to plan, not to talk about the plans. Is that right? No, because I need to talk about the plans. You always talk about the plans every day. This is the day because I will paint, I'll talk about the plan. I will write, let's talk about the plan. I will go out, let's talk about the plan. And I time we can talk about the plan. It's enough for today. We talk every day about the plans and talk about everything today. Well, okay? But when I talk about the future mm. and needing security, you always kind of say, well, we'll talk about it later. I don't want to push you at all, no. but I feel I need to I make plans. Okay. I just want Go a little yes, bit. Yeah. Okay, let's go. It's okay. A little bit like, can we look at apartments online tonight? Maybe we can. The odd thing is, me and Osama have these wonderful, deep conversations via texting. And now it's like, do I have to get out my phone and text him to have these honest heart-to-heart -heart conversations? Now that I'm here large in person, I'm getting nothing, man. I'm getting nothing. You said that I would come here and you would love me and take care of me and you would prove it. And now it's like you just kind of like, oh, shut up, Debbie. I don't want to talk to the hand. Well, right? You don't take a patient with me. You think I'm not patient? Yep. Because you I, want to do everything right here, right now. I yeah. didn't want you to do it right now. I just wanted you to sketch an outline of our future. And we just stopped in. I mean, I will not do everything in one day. Are you crazy? We will not do everything in one day. You are sick. You have the mental sickness or something. What? It's sick times. What's yeah. going on with this lady? I don't get it, man. So you think I'm mentally ill? You're acting real cold-blooded right now. And this is making me angry, and I'm not angry in my nature. It's and making me feel hurt inside. You, and you, you don't think I'm feeling hurt right now? You don't think I hear my kids saying, Mom, I told you so, this guy can't take care of you, this guy is not going to be straight and honest with you? You don't think I can hear them saying that, Mom, be careful? I want to talk about serious things, and you act like, a, oh, you're crazy, you're mentally ill. So we talk about the plans. Our plan is you will come here and bring me to the USA, and I will go to work there, and we start our life there. We can guarantee the future here. This is our plan. And I will, from this day, never change it. If you don't accept this, we can stop all this. <laughs>